Hello, and welcome to episode four of our stem cell series with Dr. Joy Kong. Dr. Kong, we've been getting many questions about the benefits of stem cells. We got a question from Becky, a 56-year-old woman who wants to know how to maintain youthfulness in a more natural way instead of, let's say, toxic fillers or plastic surgery. Okay, so whenever we talk about youthfulness, it's really we're talking about the body's ability to regenerate. Um, I'll give you an example. When you look at a little kid, when they get a cut on their skin, uh, it's very fast. They heal very fast and it goes away. It's flawless. But when we get older, when you reach 30s, 40s, you will start to notice the scar, the, the cut takes a long time to heal and the scar takes, seems forever to disappear. So that is just a demonstration of what happens in, in the difference in your body's regenerative ability. So that happens on your skin, but it happens throughout your body. So why is there such a difference? Uh, it's because we had a lot more stem cells when we were born. When we were born, we had one in 10,000 of stem, uh, cells, our stem cells. But when we get to our teenager, it becomes one in 10,000 cells in stem cells. So that's a tenfold decrease. And when we reach our middle age becomes one in 40,000, and when we reach our 80s, it becomes one in two million cells in stem cells. So not only are the cells number, the number of the stem cells drastically decline, their ability to work and their readiness to, to, to function to help your body repair also declines. So, so the stem cells is not equal, you know, for when you're born and when you are in your 60s, those are not, even though they're stem cells, but they're not equal. So um, what, what are the properties of stem cells that helps the body heal? So stem cells have the ability to calm down inflammation and it rescues injured cells from, from death and also is able to, to replicate and differentiate to replenish the tissue that's damaged so new cells can form and the tissue is healed. So uh, when we look at skin, um, when stem cells, when you replenish stem cells, um, the skin, the reason we have this visible sign of aging is because the decreased number of stem cells and the lack of, you know, kind of a potency of the stem cells, they're not replenishing your skin as fast as it's damaged. So then you get wrinkles and they start to accumulate. So when you actually give the body stem cells and the stem cells have those ability to reduce inflammation and recruit other cells to bring in and to, to start repairing. And it also has ability to stimulate local stem cells. So these you know, stem cells that have been sitting around and not doing enough work, they get a signal so they can start to replicate and differentiate and then replenish the tissue, then you are, um, you get the regeneration and you get a more usefulness because you actually, you get the young, young cells. Um, so there are many types of stem cell uh, treatments out there. Um, for example, um, a lot of uh, doctors use um, cells from the person's fat or bone marrow. Um, but you know, you do have to realize that those cells will be your age. So that's the stem cells of your own age. Um, the cells that I prefer using is derived from birth tissue. So those are nine months old stem cells because they come from live healthy births. So these cells are more potent and they're actually secrete more anti-inflammatory factors and they have secrete more growth factors. So they're just, a, they, they have a stronger effect uh, to help your body regenerate. So um, when, when Becky is asking about um, you know, natural ways to help retain youthfulness, um, probably using stem cells will be one of the most natural ways that you can think of because that's where we came from. We all came from stem cells um, and the stem cells has this innate intelligence to help your body repair. Um, so I, you know, personally, I do regularly use stem cells to, to help me maintain my youthfulness.